This story is sponsored by Little River Medical Center. Good morning and thanks for joining us today again on Living Local Carolina. Today I'm at Little River Medical Center and I'm joined by Dr. McGinley. How are you Dr. McGinley? I'm doing wonderful. I hope you are. I am too. We've got a big topic on the board today. We're talking about breast cancer awareness. It's the month of October. Tell me, what are some stats that we're seeing right now with breast cancer? Well, we know that breast cancer is the leading cause of cancer that we see in women and the mm -hmm. second leading cause of cancer death in women. So we know that over a lifetime, one in eight will be diagnosed with breast cancer. So very common. We were just talking about how it's very preventable if you're able to screen as early as possible. Right, so uh, not exactly preventable, but detecting very early. Yes. <laughs> Important to know. <laughs> Important to know, yes. So if the earlier we can detect it, the better we can uh, treat it and the better mm -hmm. survival rates. So in your line of work, what do you do on a daily basis when it comes to scanning and treating people? So I uh, always make sure, starting at age 40 and up, for the guidelines that we remind our patients to screen for breast cancer. I'm very lucky in that I have a mammogram machine right in our hallway here. So when somebody's reluctant, I can make them feel more comfortable and say, let me just lead you down to get it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's talk about the elephant in the room. This is a pretty new technology that you guys have. It's 3D mammography, right? That's correct. So the idea of 3D means um, it's digital and you're gonna have many more images. That allows the radiologist to uh, more easily see it and see it early, a, a cancer that's coming. 50% of women have denser breast tissue. That makes it a little more difficult to see. So having the digital film, we can see that much easier. And this can be more comfortable as well. It can be. So there is uh, certainly going to be some compression involved. If you know you're more sensitive to having compression, we recommend uh, taking Tylenol or ibuprofen about an hour before. Mm. The other thing is planning it, maybe you know, scheduling it, maybe an, uh, not the week of or the uh, week before your menstrual cycle. That's when the breast tends to be more sensitive. Okay, those are really good tips. I was going to say, <laughs> those are things that you wouldn't necessarily think about. And most, most females have no problems at all tolerating it that way. All right. To break it down for somebody that might not know, describe the whole process to get a 3D mammogram. So here at Little River Medical Center, all you have to do is call and make an appointment or come on in and schedule an appointment. And we'll, we can uh, usually do it right on the spot or schedule it to when you like. But uh, when you Come for your appointment. We have a very wonderful radiology team here. They're going to make you feel very warm and kind. We have a separate changing room and then yes, this is the equipment that that'll be utilized and it takes maybe 10-15 minutes the most. Why do you think it's so important for us to talk about this kind of stuff, especially in the month of October, but in every month? Uh, it all breaks down to saving lives. The mm -hmm. sooner we can get you screened, the sooner we can find a cancer, the earlier treatment we can get, the better chance of surviving. The typical screening age for breast cancer is 40, That's but what if you have a family member who had breast cancer? Oh, great point. So we start at age 40 for those at average risk, but those who have a family history, screening will definitely start earlier, and a lot of times it depends on the age that your family member was diagnosed. So for example, if you, your mother was diagnosed with breast cancer at age 35, we'll, we would start you at age 25. Access to 3D mammography is a service available exclusively to patients of Little River Medical Center and is offered at their Little River and Carolina Forest locations. To become a patient of LRMC, you can call 843-663-8000 and dial one to speak to a representative. This story is sponsored by Little River Medical Center.